hello there aqua welcome back i hope you guys are doing well today this is going to be for anybody with aquarius placements in their chart make sure you all flip and you switch the roles take what resonates leave what doesn't fit for your situation guys thank you so much uh, for your love your support and your donations i'm sending a lot of love and light and happiness to you on your journey okay anything you guys need to know about me is going to be down below in the description box and please be aware of the fake pages that are on here and on any other social media platforms okay so aqua happy birthday guys once again i hope you guys are enjoying yourselves and staying safe okay so let's see what's coming out for you guys here all right spirit guides angels ancestors ascended masters gods and goddesses please return any spell work any dark magic that is sent to harm aqua and their loved ones me and my loved ones returning back to the sender block any interferences that could be stopping messages from coming through clear concise and precise messages from my aquas and protect me as I channel the messages here for Aquarius. So let's see, Aqua. Let's see what comes out for you all. So we have the 5D here. It says unity, oneness, unconditional love, truth, evolution, intuitive, connected, grounded, co-create, divinely guided, and high frequency. So yeah, I keep getting that for y'all, man. Okay, you have reached a high level of consciousness. And honey, it's like you're not even here no more. <laughs> Okay, you could be kind of like going to, um, you could have a partner here that you could meditate with, or you could be going to like yoga retreats, spiritual retreats, okay? Some of y'all can need to get back out like in nature, okay, or meditate a little bit more, whatever, but yeah, let's see. Okay, new love in reverse. So it says holding on to past person, closed off, not ready, strings attached, not equal, unhealed wounds, and wrong choice. Mm. Okay. Dark night of the soul in reverse. Taurus just had that upright. So it says coming out, death and rebirth, egoic self dies, liberated, empowering, spiritual awakening, evolution, and clarity. We have crown. Yeah. <laughs> Your crown chakra. So it says spiritual connection, transformation, wisdom, peace, connected to source, awake, universal conscious, enlightenment, and present. Okay, yeah, like, I don't know. Some of y'all are in a, in a spiritual union, too. Like, it's it's a twin flame union for, for some of you. Okay, but whatever this union is, spirit wants it to happen, I'm feeling. Okay, your connection to spirit is getting much, 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 much deeper. Like, I don't know if you've reached the level that you, you know what I'm saying, eight to eight on the clock. I don't know, you reached some sort of higher level of consciousness, child. So there could be somebody in your energy that can't move on from you, but I feel like you're moving on from their ass. You too have vibrational for this. <laughs> okay. What else? Yeah, Akashic Records. Damn. It say, uh, you have access to infinite database, the ability to unlock secrets from the past, present, and future. You have access to great wisdom, healing, info, and psychic connections through grounding and purification. Ciao. Guardian Angel, upright. Taurus had that in reverse. So it's a message, signs and symbols, assistance, answers, meditation. Yeah, something about meditation is significant. Listen, guidance, silent nature. Okay. So you need to get back in nature, Aquarius. Enlightenment, important, present, and protected. So yeah, you're being protected from somebody that won't let your energy go. They have all these unhealed wounds and problems and they keep making the wrong choices in their life. So I feel like your spirit team is really protecting you from this person. Okay, yeah, you turn. This came out for Taurus too, child. <laughs> Roadblock, wrong way, obstacles, conflict, dead end, disaster ahead, bad choice. Go back, trust your intuition and not right. Floodgates in reverse. Delay, slow down, self-doubt, out of alignment, worrying, no action, feel entitled, rushing, and envious of others. So I'm going to pull from the back of the deck card, Queen of Cups in reverse, and the Queen of Swords in reverse. Mm. Capricorn, breaking generational curses in reverse, sacral in reverse, tarot reader, poverty. So somebody here is getting tarot readings done or somebody used all their damn money on tarot readings. <laughs> oh. C 
secrets, opportunists in reverse, ace of wands in reverse again. This ace of wands been coming out in reverse a lot. So somebody here, somebody could be trying to get some sort of advice from a tarot reader or a medium or some sort of practitioner about how to come out of like poverty here. Somebody's sacral chakra is blocked. They can't create anything. Somebody has hit rock bottom here. It's a rock bottom shows her homeless, nostalgia, living with family, friends, or ex. Poor decisions, mental prison, trying to come up with a plan here. So yeah, somebody's trying to watch tarot readings to get some sort of guidance here about how to do whatever this is. Mm, or you could be a tarot reader. They could be trying to come to your ass. But let's see. And we got the Queen of Cups in reverse, too. It says emotionally immature, weak, needy, bitter, repressed, depressed, spiteful, insecure, drained, block creative intuition, block creative and uh, block creativity and intuition, overgiving and feel empty. And then we have Queen of Swords in reverse, rude, malicious, cheater, gossip, liar, blunt, angry, pessimistic, poor communication, infertile and repressed trauma. This is somebody, for some of you, this Queen of Swords been coming out as somebody mama. This could be an Aquarius woman that just keep on coming out. And this Queen of Cups is somebody daughter. Boy, well, this could be their daughter. This could be, like, I'm hearing, like, mother-in-law, daughter-in-law type shit. Okay, or this could be your own damn daughter or your own damn mama or whatever this is. But there could be, like, a masculine here that's dating this Queen of Cups in reverse and their mama is involved. Okay, or this could be the same hoe. This Queen of Cups in reverse. Queen of Swords in reverse. Somebody here that's just a mess. <laughs> okay. Mm. Um, look at the card I left. This Ace of Wands, man. 0707, you could be seeing, or 707. This Ace of Wands been coming out a lot in reverse. So what's this 5D here? You got a lot of protection around you right now, Aquarius, because it's a lot of bullshit going on. What's the 5D card? Yeah, the moon. I feel, I feel like this is your energy being cloaked and protected. Definitely, yeah, the emperor with the four wands. So definitely twin flame energy. But I'm also getting a lot of stability and security here coming in. But cancer energy with the moon. So... I feel like you know that there's deception or there's there's some bullshit going on here. Your intuition is heightening as well. I feel like you could see a lot right now. Okay, if you're paying attention. Some of you guys could be getting messages through your dream state. Or there's a need for you to fucking um, meditate more. Aquarius, make this a part of your daily routine so you can get in touch with your, your spirit team, your angels, your ancestors, your guides. Okay, they want you to get closer to them is what I'm getting. So maybe get an altar, okay, and start... You know, doing offerings and things like that. What's the 5D with the moon? Maybe write down your dreams too if you're dreaming a lot or... Okay, damn, nine of swords. So the moon with the nine of swords... So somebody here is nervous. They scared as hell. Okay, someone could have a Gemini Mars. Somebody is nervous as fuck here. Because Spirit trying to talk to their stupid ass. Like, Spirit is saying something to somebody now. Like, you need to get your shit together, buddy. <laughs> like, your ass about to get taken up out of here. Yeah. Somebody here could be being haunted. Someone is scared as fuck because they don't know what's coming, but you do, possibly. You know what's coming for their ass, but they don't know. Okay, nine of swords with the moon. Someone's anxiety is through the roof. What's the nine of swords? It's something about a secret that's haunting somebody. Someone can't even sleep. What's the nine of swords? There's so much fear and, and worry and stress. What's the nine of swords? Yeah, somebody restless as fuck. Four of swords in reverse. Libra, Jupiter. So somebody is nervous about the fact that you could have awakened here with the with um with the four of swords in reverse. Okay, you're finding that mental strength again. You're coming out of some sort of 
mental in prison for some of you or, or like your mind is getting strong. I feel like something too with your health, your nervous system is getting much better or strengthening or something like that. Like things are balancing out with your health as well. But this four of swords in reverse, alternatively with the nine of swords upright could mean that somebody is like really restless or they, they, they mind is just like scattered. They can't even think straight. This could be somebody too though that's refusing to get help though. They feel like they don't need help or they don't need this. They don't need that, but they do. Yeah, six of, six of Pentacles. Somebody does need help with something. Mm, this could be somebody from your past with the Six of Cups or a child for some of you. What's the moon? The Four of Pentacles. Capricorn, sun, somebody could be. Let me see something. Last night, I was looking up Claire Augustine's. That's like, uh, and it says Claire Augustine's and Claire, Claire Lefactance or something like that. Claire Lefactance, Claire Lefactance. The fact tense is the psychic sense of clear smelling because obviously I've been smelling shit like just out of nowhere. Yesterday I smelled something about a barbecue like I smelled and I was in here. So I know anybody can't nobody barbecue like that around where I'm staying at. Like, you know what I'm saying? They got to do it somewhere else or something. So it's just like, what the fuck? I've been smelling shit. I've been smelling like cologne. <laughs> okay, like it's been weird. But anyways, let me see. Some of y'all are getting new gifts, okay? You, you're you able, your senses are heightening for sure. I'm gonna look up something real fast. Mm, oh, mental breakdown. Yeah, I mean, that's what it is, child. What the fuck? Mental breakdown, collapse, burnout, restless. It's not taking care of yourself, lack of protection. Oh, <laughs> that's a big one. Not accepting counseling. Yeah, like I said, somebody feel like they don't need help or support or losing faith. Yeah. Mm. Okay, yeah, I wanted to look up this four swords, four swords a little bit more. You guys would be seeing four, four, four. This person ain't got no faith to begin with. Ain't no lack of faith. The only reason they had faith was because they were doing wicked ass shit. And now... It's not working. <laughs> Somebody here, I feel like they could be penny pinching or they, they're holding something close to their chest though. It's like something here they just don't want to release. They don't want to, I feel like your energy they don't want to release. But there's a secret here. There's a secret that's haunting their ass. Like they just are not, child, they, they struggling with holding on to this shit. But you can see with the and with the five D here, you can see somebody for who the fuck they are. So I don't know. This person's delusional. <laughs> I feel like somebody's greedy, they stingy, possessive, controlling. But they holding something close to their chest. They they scared as hell. What's new love in reverse? This would be two where somebody's money is fucked up. Ace of Swords. What's new love in reverse with the Ace of Swords? Yeah, the Seven of Wands. So there's definitely like a breakthrough here. There's there's a lot of truth and clarity coming in for you, Aquarius. You could be getting a lot of downloads right now, a lot of um intuitive hits. Okay, like spirit is definitely letting you know a lot about somebody's ass. Someone could have a Leo Mars here. So the truth has come out about this person here not wanting to move on from you. Like they just won't leave you the fuck alone. Okay, like they, they have some sort of unhealed wounds here that, that need to be healed. And I feel like what they're doing is playing around in your energy. That's not, This person here is crazy as fuck. They just come out in different readings in different ways <laughs> or whatever. It's the same nasty spirit that keep coming out. But Seven of Wands is you standing your ground. You're seeing the truth of a situation and you're defending yourself. You're protecting your territory. They ask is blocked and your guardian angel is blocking this person. And a bitter-ass mama and a bitter-ass ex-girlfriend or whatever this is. 
Okay, this Queen of Cups in reverse, Queen of Swords in reverse. Or oh, that's the same bitch, and they stuck with that hoe. They stuck over there. What's the Seven of Wands? Or matter of fact, what's the Ace of Swords? Yeah, the devil. You see somebody as a fucking devil. They are. They are. Somebody who wants you to keep trauma bonding or going in a, in a, in a karmic cycle with their ass. No. You guys would be saying 515. Strong Capricorn here, possibly. Mm. Or you could be on the cusp, Aquarius. I feel like you're finding out, too, about the people that this person is around or who all is involved. Because I feel like it's not just this person. It's these hoes. I feel like for some of you, I'm talking about a man. Okay, these are two women that are involved with a man, but this could be the other way around. So, you know, flip it. These could be even friends, family members, your rude ass, nasty ass mama and your nasty ass sister, queen of cups, or this could be any damn body. But I feel like you just really are blocking these people out because they bitter as fuck. They bitter. They they mad as hell because they let their life pass them by without doing the work that they needed to do to become, to be in your, your situation, in your place in life. And so... Okay. Oh, well, it's the dark night of the soul in reverse. So this is you. <clears throat> mm -mm. Yeah, six of wands in reverse, eight of cups in reverse. Leo, Jupiter, Pisces, Saturn. Someone could have an H chart. So yeah, these are people around you, Aquarius, that I just feel like are bitter as fuck. They they clout hungry. They're they're opportunistic. Okay, they're fame hungry. They're they're in their ego. They they pride too big. Okay. They lost at this battle, whatever the fuck this is. These are people with horrible intentions. That's why people are fucked up now, because your intentions are bad. If you were a good person, you wouldn't be going through half of the shit you, you're going through right now, ho. <laughs> like, you you will be somewhere in, in life. These are people here that stuck as fuck. Eight of Cups in reverse, they got insecurities, abandonment wounds. They, they fake situations. They stay in situations where they fake happy to impress other people. It's just like, well, all right. And the world and a star. And this is you. Moving the fuck on here. The cycle has completed. You're healing. You're recouping. You're, you feel rejuvenated. Okay. Some of you guys could have a... Could be seen online here with the world and the star. Or some of you guys could, could be um, doing something online that's um, helping to heal, uh, heal and guide others. Some of you guys are astrologers here. Really good astrologers. I really admire astrologers, man, because for some, like, I'm at an intermediate phase of astrology, but child, some shit I just don't understand about astrology. I'm trying to, I got books in here that I'm reading, because I know astrology and tarot go hand to hand, but, well, to me it does, but, um, you could be, um, starting classes here online to teach people things. Okay, or you have some sort of star quality about you, or you could be an up and coming star. I don't know, but you can heal people all over the world here. Like you have a bigger purpose to fulfill. You don't have time to sit around and be complacent with these hoes. People like staying stuck and being complacent. I feel like, yeah, you're not doing that. Page of Wands, Four of Wands. You got big shoes to fill. You have new exciting plans here. It's like, no. So what's the Six of Wands in reverse? So these people lost here because you're coming out of a dark night of the soul. You're healing. You have passed your test. You did what you needed to do. To grow. Yeah, look at this bitch. Queen of Pentacles in reverse. <sighs> so that's somebody here that is... So somebody here could be stuck with a Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody here made a U-turn or they made the wrong turn. Okay, because I don't this could be either your mama, your sister, your brother, whatever the fuck. But I feel like there's somebody here that's hiding right now. It's this person. Then there's four of pentacles, the moon, four of swords in reverse, and the nine of swords. And I feel like that's more so of a masculine energy that's hiding because they asked and chose this queen of pentacles in reverse, queen of cups in reverse, queen of swords in reverse. I mean, this person could be all one person. They're a shape shifting asshole. <laughs> they just shape shifted their way into whoever's life, yours or theirs or whoever. But these could be hoes that are just jealous of you, sending spell work your way. Okay, hoes that are attention seeking. They use their pussy and their raggedy ass dick for 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 validation, or they they want to feel like they they somebody. And it's just like, bitch, please. <laughs> I'm so over this.
Immuniz immuni immunization clinic. Yeah, no. My baby will not be getting no fucking immuniz immunizations, whatever the fuck this is. Unless, you know. <laughs> no. No. Mm -hmm. Somebody here could be a healthcare provider, a nurse, or you're a healer of some, some sort. Uh, okay, I need to look at that. Okay, sorry guys, that's something about my son's school. This wig is in the back, damn. All right, so yeah, so this Queen of Pentacles in reverse with the Six of Wands in reverse. So this is somebody here that got some sort of smear campaign. Six of Wands in reverse is definitely a smear campaign, Queen of Pentacles in reverse. So somebody here got someone to like bully you or send some sort of spell work your way and the same bitch that's doing this to you is doing this to their clown ass. Because it's not working on you. They fail big time at doing this shit to you. What's the Six of Wands in reverse? Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Get a star. Some of you guys are seen in a public eye. You get a lot of attention. Okay, or something like that. So somebody has sent dark witches your way. A dark witch. Okay. They use these people to do this to you. That's what this is. What's this Eight of Cups in reverse? That's you, Aquarius. What's the Eight of Cups in reverse? The Ten of Swords. Okay, yeah. So, <laughs> Gemini Sun. Somebody just stuck in their own mess. This Ten of Swords is definitely like a betrayal, an abrupt ending, a failure, ruin. Okay, it could be a curse or a hex here that somebody is doing. With the Queen of Pentacles in reverse, is definitely that. Okay, I feel like you're seeing who the culprit is behind all this. You're getting like the full truth about something because I feel like honestly, whoever this is is a coward. Whoever the fuck this is is a coward. These hoes, all of them scared. But there's somebody in particular that started this shit. They're the coward. They're hiding. Okay. Everybody else is getting exposed so clear except whoever the fuck this is. Okay. Yeah. So. Who chow? What is, uh. Somebody got somebody ass stuck because they don't want to do that healing work. That's why they stuck over here with this, this bitch here. And the shit, it looks like it's returning to their ass. Okay. What's crown? This, this work, whatever this is. What's this crown chakra? This spell work working heavy on somebody because they don't want to heal their abandonment wounds. Eight of cups in reverse. I feel like somebody's non-committal. They don't commit to shit. They they just a mess. Five of Wands, Seven of Cups. There's a whole lot of chaos, confusion. What's the crown chakra here? And this is you at peace. Yeah, the chariot. This is you. <laughs> Cancer energy. You moving on, child. This is you um, coming out victorious. You guys, <laughs> excuse me, could be seeing 717. But this is your ass, honey. Moving on. Happy as fuck. Celebrating. Without a care or a worry in the world, you're at peace. You're balanced with the chariot. You know, love wins over hate here. Being a hateful asshole never gets you nowhere. You bitches are learning that. <laughs> okay, hopefully you're learning it. If not, that's on your ass. What's, what's the uh, crown chakra with the chariot? So I feel like um this, this talks about determination, drive, willpower. Um, but you're definitely coming out triumphant and victorious. Your spirit team here is God and the fuck out of your ass. Yeah, nine of wands, a wounded warrior. You wounded, but you coming out strong here. Okay, period. Someone could have a Sag moon. Or you could have somebody in your energy that's like this, that's helping you fight this battle. But I feel like this is your spirit team. Something has been an ongoing battle here. It's been a lot of fighting. I feel like you're defending yourself. You're fighting back. You have this warrior spirit. Yeah, five of 
wands, seven of cups, two of wands, and the damn justice. <laughs> What's the Akashic Records? Six of Swords in reverse. What's Akashic Records here? Someone can have an Aquarius Mercury placement. King of Swords in reverse. Got the King of Swords in reverse. King of Queen of Swords in reverse. Mm. Two lying assholes. <laughs> Cold in here. So this King of Swords in reverse is someone that's scatterbrained. This person can't even think straight. Somebody is just they can't make logical decisions. Okay, they all over the place. But this is a fucking liar. Somebody here that's manipulative. They try to like dictate shit. They they feel like they're in control or they're very controlling, manipulative. I feel like this person is mentally abusive too. So is this Queen of Swords in reverse. These could even be two people. This King of Swords, Queen of Swords in reverse could be two people outside of whatever this is that's going on. Because there's a lot of people involved. People that uh, know how to tap into people's Akashic records. And the 5D to fuck with. Um, to, to steal from other people. Or to like switch some things around. So that's, that could be what this person has gotten a hold of or they've got somebody to like do this for them, to you. Six of Swords in reverse. I feel like you're standing your ground against this person. Okay, because that's definitely standing, somebody standing their ground. But this could talk about too, like a natural disaster or someone that is trapped or they delayed or stuck. What's this Six of Swords in reverse? This could be too like slow progress, slow healing. So somebody here slowed you down. All right, they definitely slowed you down. What's what's the Six of Swords in reverse? Or Three of Swords, Libra, Saturn. Yeah, and the Queen of Swords. Yeah, look at this shit. I mean, these are two fucking liars, lying ass hoes that are attacking your subconscious using magic. Okay. Yeah, this person here, they stuck. This Queen of Swords in reverse, King of Swords. Now, these are people that I'm getting, I'm hearing something about a cult, a coven. Definitely that, okay? But these could be these two idiots that are together. They both are lying to each other about a lot of shit, just period. But this Queen of Swords in reverse is someone that's, that's a liar. They're gossiping. I feel like you and somebody are just not saying shit to each other at all. You don't have shit to say to them. <laughs> okay. I feel like you had a good reason to not say shit to them, but you could have been bitter or upset at a certain point in your journey too. I mean, that's normal, but I mean, you get over it. Stop being a victim and just heal. But who this queen of swords in reverse? Somebody here lied or gave somebody the wrong fucking advice to cause heartbreak or to slow something down or... Somebody knew that something was going to hurt somebody, so they, they went on ahead and did it. Somebody just nasty like that. What's the Queen of Swords in reverse? Somebody, I'm getting the situation too, yeah. Something about your childhood here. Somebody was lied to about their dad or their mama. Some of y'all going to be finding out that your mom is a fucking liar. <laughs> they They lied about your dad and, and what happened and why, why they was never around or something like that. I mean, no excuse really, but I'm just saying, you know, these hoes, they definitely do be lying. They try to make themselves look better. That's why I don't like bitches because that's what they do. They, because they're women, they try to make themselves look better or, or they want to make it seem like, oh, they're so innocent, bitch. No, you bitches are the scandalous bitches I've ever seen. Okay, y'all be worse than men. Real shit. So you got a bitter ass woman here. Let me see. What's the Queen of Swords in reverse? What is their problem? Yeah, the Eight of Swords. 
So somebody has just a negative way of thinking. They're very pessimistic. I feel like somebody did do magic. They're doing magic and shit like that or getting magic done or put on somebody to cause them to be scatterbrained or nasty towards you or something like that. Somebody here preys on someone's weaknesses, they they mental health. Somebody does that shit on purpose. What's the Queen of Swords in reverse? I mean King of Swords in reverse. The Page of Wands. Yeah, what's the King of Swords in reverse with the Page of Wands? Wow. I, I swear, man, this damn ace of wands, this empress, this fertility, this fucked up energy. This, these, this shit here is just ridiculous. So somebody here gave someone bad advice to go into spirit, go into somebody Akashic Records here, go into spirit and bind somebody's fucking sacral. The Empress in reverse with the Ace of Wands in reverse. Or somebody here decided to send a distorted masculine to an Empress in reverse, a false feminine, somebody that can't... Um, birth anything or create anything they're they're jealous they're manipulative they're nasty as fuck okay so they decided to tell this person to go that way instead of going the other way okay instead of going the way that they they know that they're supposed to be going when it when it comes down to you right so this was somebody's new exciting plans here page of wands somebody here literally blocked off a divine feminine sacral energy like totally shut it down Okay, so if you've been having problems conceiving, Ace of Wands in reverse, Empress in reverse, somebody here binded, somebody gave someone advice or they, they went to a, 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 a practitioner to get somebody's, uh, get a divine feminine sacral energy, bind it out, or they did some sort of womb magic or whatever. Because I feel like, honestly, you kept on creating. Okay, you kept on stepping into your purpose, but when it comes down to binding and, and all that shit, a sac your... your uh, fucking with your reproductive system here this is a mess somebody here literally tried to stop a baby from coming ace of wands in reverse page of wands upright and the damn ace of the empress in reverse somebody's seen what was going on in someone's uh akashic records they, they try to see what was coming in for somebody this is a really skilled practitioner occultist bitch you getting ready to get it first Whoever decided that they was going to do that and they knew better. All right. Okay. So somebody, this King of Swords here, they lied though. They lied. But I feel like this person here was framed. They was definitely set up, but they it's because they need to do their fucking healing work. They wouldn't have been able to be set up if they fucking, if they did what they needed to do internally. You would be able to see that these people around you are fucking losers. Somebody was using your energy to fucking create with other people. This is a mess. Somebody moves out of fear, paranoia. Somebody has really mental health, like really bad mental health issues. It's this fucking queen of swords, eight of swords. This person here says a lot of nasty things to, I feel like, a king of swords in reverse that puts them in their head. And they are, they see that this person is already heartbroken. They're already fucked up. So they just decided to prey on this person. All to get to you. This is a mess. Mm. I feel like this is past energy too. Something here, you've been being attacked for like a very long time. This queen of swords in reverse here, somebody mama. This bitch here, or this somebody mama and a daddy, king of swords in reverse, queen of swords in reverse, two idiots that are going in the spirit. They have uh, knowledge about doing shit like that to steal someone's destiny or stop somebody from moving forward. Some of you guys have new exciting plans here, but you couldn't move forward because somebody's in your energy lying on you and, and doing shit to you or saying shit about you to people that's attacking you and it's causing them to attack you even more. That's what I'm saying. This is a this is nasty here. Whatever this is. Aries Leo Sag Taurus Libra. What's this Empress in reverse, man?
two jealous hoes. Queen of Cups in reverse. Queen of Swords in reverse. What's this Empress in reverse? Yeah, three of Cups. A third party. Every time you will get with somebody or, or make a new friend, yeah, something would automatically come to an end. Okay, it's like they, they was doing that shit. What's the... But this Queen of Swords in reverse, so they gave this masculine bad advice to go to a karmic where they can't create shit. And I feel like they did that so that way they can they can target you. It's like you're the target here. They they didn't want this masculine to come towards you or whatever the fuck. So they decided they was gonna fucking set some shit up a certain way to in order to main to, in order to get to to keep you around, but also keep you at a distance. You get what I'm saying? Somebody think they real fucking clever, bitch. You're not that fucking smart. Loser ass. This is what's this page of wands? It's like somebody is so distorted. They're really disinterested in this third party. They're really disinterested in this third party. But they decide to, I don't know. That's why I said they mind is fucked up. What's the page of wands? Yeah, nine of cups. Something was just sexual. Page of wands, nine of cups. It's just sexual gratification. That's all that it is. Page of wands, nine of cups. What's page of wands, nine of cups? Because that's, that's a pregnancy. Okay, what's this page of wands, nine of cups? Somebody here use your energy. <laughs> yeah, seven of swords. They stole it, y'all. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Somebody could have an Aquarius moon. Yeah, this was a sacrifice. They work with other people to do this shit here. Mm, mm, mm. This is all to steal someone's abundance, security, wealth, prosperity. Yeah. So this could be a karma couple too. They all liars, but they family and other people are involved too, though. Now somebody's scared, bitch. What you scared for? <laughs> why <are> you scared? <laughs> I just, I don't, I don't understand why you bitches do shit and then you get scared. What the fuck is your pussy ass scared of? Comment below. <laughs> I want to know why the fuck are you scared? They never comment when I tell them to comment. They never do. Instead, they want to make fake pages to bully somebody. Bitch, comment and show your real fucking face. Stop being a hoe because I'm going to keep ignoring your your clown ass. You keep coming up under these fake ass pages, bitch. All you're going to do is get blocked. I'm not arguing with nobody fake, bitch. Be real for once in your fucking raggedy ass. Fucked up ass, short of a span ass life because shit. You getting ready to fucking not be here in a minute with this stupid shit that you got going on. My dead ass. Child, please. This is a mess. What's this Ace of Wands in reverse? The Hierophant. Yeah, somebody went to some sort of cult or something. Okay, like a social group. The hyphen is a social group. Is is they went somewhere to get some sort of work done, to go into somebody akashic records to steal energy, and they did that shit from that nine of cups page of wands energy. I mean, that's that's obviously prosperity, abundance. That has a lot to do with your sacred energy. Page of wands, ace of wands, nine of cups. Okay, like what what the fuck? Two lion ass hoes. To slow you down. <laughs> What's this guardian angel here? And this this Empress in reverse. This is the karmic feminine. This is they, they bitch ass friends. This person here got these friends or these people that knew how to do this work to do this. And now people want to hide and shit. Like I swear when I see my karmic I just be like bitch. I mean, what the fuck I gotta say? I ain't I ain't saying shit, bitch. You the one that started this shit. You need to speak up. Now you nervous and shit, bitch. Why the fuck you nervous? Because you know your ass, your ass getting ready to be sent up out of here, you fucking clown. Like, that's what the fuck your ass get. What the fuck? What's guardian angel? Judgment day not, not looking too good for you, bitches. Yeah, nine of pentacles. And you're a damn guardian angel. I feel like your guardian angel is protecting you, but I feel like you're a nice angel. Just period. Virgo, Venus here you can have in your chart. What's guardian angel with the nine of pentacles? Or spirit has sent you, uh, yeah, the fool. Aquarius. Okay. <laughs> Tell 
So yeah, you freed yourself. Nine of Pentacles with the Fool. You completely freed yourself out of this mess. Like dead ass. Child. You completely freed yourself. Okay, you're off to a new beginning. I feel like your, your business is going to be very successful as well with the Nine of Pentacles. But this is you enjoying the fruits of your labor or you getting ready to. But you definitely, you're free, you're unbothered. Whatever this shit is over here is just a mess. I feel like, honestly, <laughs> I don't know what the fuck, man. They the ones now in the Empress in reverse, Ace of Wands in reverse. This is you. They got new exciting plans. They keep on trying to steal from your fucking sacral energy. Page of Wands, Nine of Cups. I feel like you're getting wish fulfillment for some of you when it comes down to a child. This could be uh, the announcement of an engagement as well. Okay, I feel like something about this energy is being hidden. Seven of Swords or is undetectable. <laughs> These are hoes that scared. This bitch over here then probably got themselves in, in some sort of accident. But it's this fucking backfire. It's this backfire from this fucking magic that they, whoever they hired to do this dumbass shit. And I feel like with the higher and upright, I feel like you're in some sort of sacred contract or a covenant that's that's protected. You could be in a higher level of commitment or in a union with somebody. Somebody keep on trying to do this stupid shit to say they own ass. Bitch, fuck you. And whoever the fuck you roll with. Y'all hold some pussies, I swear. These people that, that do this shit behind the scenes but don't want to comment, I feel like that's some lame ass shit. The only time they got power or strength or they feel like they, they strong enough is when they're hidden. It's like you bitches don't ever do shit to somebody's face. It's always behind their back. That's that's lame as fuck. What's the nine of pentacles? Like that's some pussy ass shit. I feel like that's so lame. <laughs> yeah, page of pentacles. Some of you guys are tarot readers here. The high priestess, page of pentacles, nine of pentacles. Like I feel like you've built a life off of your spiritual gifts alone. Literally. <laughs> Somebody here mad as fuck. What's the nine of pentacles, page of pentacles? Some of you guys are readers or you're, you're spiritual practitioners or you're studying something with the page of pentacles, but I feel like you have good news as far as your finances. We got that one page of pentacles and this nine of pentacles. So that's what, 10 of pentacles? I feel like this is what you're getting. This is what you're stepping into, a 10 of pentacles situation. What's this nine of pentacles, page of pentacles? Somebody has some sort of new exciting plan or they had some sort of strategy or whatever. Yeah, Ace of Cups. Some of you guys, there's going to be a birth of a child here. Like dead ass. There's going to be a birth of a child here. There's definitely a new emotionally fulfilling beginning though when it comes down to new career opportunities and new pathways opening up for your, for your money, your finances. Something that you're studying too is going to emotionally fulfill you because it could be something that you did in a past life. But I feel like you could have new love coming in as well. There's something that you're building off of a solid foundation. This is this guardian angel. For some of you, your new beginning here, you got with somebody. There's somebody that you with that's building something with you. Okay. Somebody could be wanting to buy you something. It's Page of Pentacles. Let me see. This could be like a gift or like a piece of jewelry or something tangible. What's the Page of Pentacles? But I feel like... Um, this could be two more downloads, more upgrades spiritually. Some of y'all getting introduced to... Okay, yeah, the high priestess in reverse. Oh, that's what I was looking at. What's this page of pentacles with the high priestess in reverse? Hmm. Okay, yeah. Knight of Cups and the King of Wands. <laughs> the Emperor. Yeah, no, bitch. Something here. I mean, okay, so the high priestess in reverse could talk about somebody having outbursts or something here is just out of control. Uh, unwanted attention. So I feel like your spirit team or guardian angel here has warned you about something that somebody tried to give you. This page of pentacles could have been like some sort of like um, gift or something that someone was trying to give you to reattach their energy to you. It could be like something that's cursed or hacked. So I feel like you, you freed yourself from it. You threw that shit away. Just period. For others of you, 
This could be um, just unwanted attention with somebody here that you're dating, okay? I don't know. I don't really like the King of Wands sometimes. Like, they've been coming out as fucking idiots in my reading. Hmm. But yeah, I feel like this is just somebody sending you unwanted attention. Somebody here wanted to stop you from getting with somebody that's a go-getter, a lead, a real leader, an entrepreneur that's successful, somebody that's handsome, or they, they're very valuable to you. And I feel like somebody just wants to distract you or stop you from doing certain things, from building and growing. They wanted to stop you from getting to this damn offer with somebody else's ass. Party is so fucking lame. I, I, I just, I don't know. What's U-turn? <laughs> the dad, Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, somebody's like a fucking... So somebody's trying to return, but I feel like they're trying to return through your energetic field. Okay. So spirit right now is guiding you away from this shit. Ten of Pentacles in reverse is illegal activity. There's like instability. Okay, there's a dysfunctional family dynamic somewhere. Everybody's fighting and arguing and all that. Okay, over money. This is somebody here that fakes their wealth or somebody here faked their wealth or somebody set someone up. Somebody scammed the fuck out of somebody and said, oh, I'm gonna give you this. I'm gonna help you do that. If you did it, da 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 Ciao. This Ten of Pentacles in reverse too is like breaking traditions. So this is um somebody here being a trendsetter. They 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 building their own generation and shit like that. Okay, that could be that too. What's the U-turn with the Ten of Pentacles in reverse? Yeah, Eight of Wands, Knight of Swords, Five of Cups. Yeah, that's. This is not working. But, you know, Eight of Wands here. We got Sag Mercury. So this is you that is moving in a positive direction because you have um, outgrown whatever the fuck this is. You've broken some generational curse here. Okay, now somebody wants to come back or they want to make a U-turn. I feel like for some of you, somebody's family member could want to reach out to you or a family member could want to reach out to you, but that would be the wrong turn. I feel like your spirit team warned you of this. This was a setup. Somebody here tried to do some stupid shit to cause a distraction. And I feel like you fucking averted that tower from happening. Something that was going to call you a, cause you a conflict or this could be like a cursed gift or something that could have caused an accident. If you would have took it and actually used it or activated it some type of way, it would have caused an accident. It could have fucked up your travel plans or your car or, or something like that. Yeah, you trusted your intuition. Something didn't, it, it, you know, it's because these people, because we got the dark night of the soul in reverse. So it's because these people see that you're growing, you're maturing, you're doing this, you're doing that, and they're losing big time. They've been losers. But they, they're trying to fucking do shit to you. So it's somebody that you're connected to that's connected to these people that are trying to get to you. This person as well is trying to like do shit to you too. But I feel like they ass getting tore the fuck up. So, I mean... What's the set of pentacles in reverse, man? I this is this is just ridiculous. As much as I try to get away from these kind of readings, they just it's still coming out. I mean, and I mean I enjoy reading on it because the shit funny and I like uncovering shit like that. So I mean it works for me, bitch. But you know, some days I don't feel like talking about you hoes. What's the ten of pentacles in reverse? Yeah, the two of wands, and they sit back and wait. What, what's the what's the two of wands here with the ten of pentacles in reverse? <laughs> So somebody here made some sort of plan or strategy to steal something. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. I mean, yeah, what's Ten of Pentacles in reverse? Yeah, the hangman. This is some sort of sacrificial shit to keep you stuck. Yeah, the lovers. I feel like these could also be lessons to Aquarius that you've been through. You've been with um, people along your path. But it was done due to, I mean, it was it was due to like spell work. You've been with the wrong individuals, the soulmates or whatever. While, all while you were being sacrificed. It's like people were trying to do spell work on you to confuse you about who your person is, where you're supposed to be going, what you're supposed to be doing this whole time. 
to steal your energy. They wanted to keep you in a certain spot or predicament in your journey so, so that way they can keep siphoning from you and stealing from you. And these bitches could keep celebrating and doing whatever the fuck, literally manifesting off of your energy alone. You got to really realize how powerful you are for people to like target you. <laughs> you alone, like you and nobody else, just you. <laughs> that, they live in their a dream life off of your energy. Just imagine like dead ass. That's crazy. But I do feel like this is positive energy, though. Two of Wands, the hangman with the lovers. I feel like you have shifted your perspective here and you're planning for your future with your damn person, with the lovers. I feel like you made a decision. Y yeah, the two of Wands, the, heart, the hangman and the lovers. You made some sort of major decision because your spirit team warned you of a U-turn. Your spirit team warned your ass to not take something from somebody, not do something, not go this place, not go there. Your, your steps are literally being divinely guided and protected. And you went in the opposite direction. Okay. I feel like somebody family member gave this masculine the wrong advice. They told this masculine what to do and they they listen. This person here had a choice to make and they chose the wrong way and that's on their ass. What's the eight of wands? Oh well, bitch. Somebody's intuition is blocked completely or somebody was trying to send you something to block yours. The high priestess in reverse could talk about too, like um, oh, I'm getting some else too. The high priestess in reverse could talk about somebody doubting their intuition. Their intuition is telling them which way to go, but they doubting it, so they they're not listening to it. This could also be a a, a uh offer coming from this dark feminine here to this king of wands. This king of wands is dating somebody like a dark witch. They're dating a dark witch. They took an offer from this person. And that's why spirit is guiding you away from this person because they, they're too busy in their ego. That's what I get with this King of Wands. They're too busy in their fucking ego here. And these bitches just been trying to get to you the whole fucking time. What's this Eight of Wands, Cheryl? These jealous ass hoes. I feel like every time this masculine date a damn a bitch, it's, they're jealous of you every time. Every single time. This person here just attracts a lot of jealous, nasty ass bitches. And then they keep targeting you. And it's like, you don't even care about this bitch. But they didn't sat up here, what, and lied and said that you do or something. Or they family. Somebody, this person family here guided them towards this, these hoes. This is a mess. What's the eight of wands? Because they don't want to see them prosper. Yeah, I'm telling you, you got downloads from your spirit team. This is a damn spirit guide. This king of cousins is always my spirit guide card. But this could also be too... Um, you moving forward towards a Scorpio. This is somebody here that loves you genuinely. They care about you. They 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 want to marry you. They want to be with you. You're breaking generational curses with this person. Or you have, so you can meet this person. Yeah, look. The Tower, the Emperor, and the Queen of Cups. The Two of Cups and the Eight of Pentacles. Exactly. Let me see. What's the Eight of Wands with the King of Cups? I feel like you're moving away from somebody because they ain't break shit. They keep doing the same shit over and over again. What's the Eight of Wands with the King of Cups? For some of you, somebody sent a... Um, you and this person could be at a distance. These hoes here, they sent a... Something here to fuck up somebody's travel plans. So somebody sent something somewhere to cause an accident for somebody. And I feel like what happened was you or your person got a download not to go. Or something got in the way of that travel plan and you didn't go. So something didn't work. Now it's going back. Okay, whatever the fuck this is to hurt somebody... It's going backwards. Okay. Yeah, the four of cups. Yeah, spirit told you to miss the opportunity. Spirit told you to not go or not do it. Or you communicated to somebody to not do something or something like that. It's like these people are trying to find every which way to stop something from happening, to stop you from getting this Ten of Pentacles. They would even go as far as hurting somebody, getting somebody damn near killed and, and labeling it as a fucking natural disaster. No, it's spell work, bitch. It's spell work. Then I feel like somebody has sent you a gift. Somebody sent you some shit that's also hexed and cursed, and you didn't you didn't fucking indulge in that or use that or feel like you threw that shit right in the trash. I know I did. I threw that shit in the trash. At first, I thanked the bitch because I, I think I told y'all that. At first, I thanked her because I didn't really realize what was going on until like a couple days later. 
and I did a reading and something here, something came to me. I threw that shit in the trash so fast, man. Far away from my damn place. Bitch, fuck no. Somebody here really be trying this shit. I feel like you were discontent about something, but you did it anyway because somebody here was trying to steal energy, Ten of Pentacles. What's this floodgates in reverse? Well, now this bitch is sitting up here, over here hurt. Six of swords in reverse. Somebody here got some sort of, they getting ready to get fucked up. What's this, the floodgates in reverse? Yeah, strong card in reverse. Yeah, somebody is weak. They feel inadequate or their health is bad. Leo energy in reverse. The strength card in reverse, rather. Somebody feel entitled to your fucking energy. What's the floodgates in reverse? Strong card in reverse. The emperor. <laughs> so somebody here feels inadequate because there's an emperor here that's came in. Or this could be a father figure that, that wants complete control and they feel... Like, they deserve you, and bitch, you don't deserve nothing. <laughs> but to be, I ain't even gonna say that. That's mean. But, Spirit, you know what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. That's how I feel. So, because somebody is out of alignment, and they weak, they want to interfere with your energy. No. <laughs> and I feel like this bitch still working with these other people. Or they too stupid to see that that that's what's, that this is going to be their demise. Two of swords, five of swords, seven of cups, the death card. Child, what's the strong card in reverse? Page of swords in reverse and the sun in reverse. Yeah, somebody's not too enthused. Somebody's sending the evil eye. They mad as hell. It could be a Leo, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Somebody here. This is somebody here that you're not even speaking to. You don't want to have shit to do with this bitch. Okay. I feel like somebody's paranoid. They got anxiety. Someone is pessimistic. They feel sad or hurt or they mad because they ain't coming out victorious and some shit. Just in their ego. Real heavy. Somebody's like evil eyeing the fuck out of somebody. Whoever this is. Or they trying to send evil eyes to this masculine. What's the emperor? <sighs> they, they're saying that their little shit is not working. They can't even see shit. The sun in reverse. There's no enlightenment or they can't. They, yeah, the hermit. They can't see nothing because you have spiritual protection here. What's the what's the emperor? Yeah, the eight of pentacles in reverse. Virgo here. What's the what's the what's the emperor with the eight of pentacles in reverse? What's the hermit again. So Virgo energy. So so this could be your masculine could have Virgo and Aries in their chart somewhere too. Okay, because I really do feel like there's a masculine here that's trying to mimic another masculine that's supposed to be in your energy. They're supposed to be your person. Okay, and they are. But these hoes, man. This masculine here is dating the dark witch. And they these hoes are on you heavy. I feel like it's more so these bitches here that are attacking you versus this masculine. This masculine here has brought a whole team of bitches your way, though. And convince this masculine for some of you that you're the one attacking them because, what, you're spiritual or you do whatever. That was a plan. Uh, this is this is crazy, but um, the Eight of Pentacles in reverse is like somebody hitting a dead end. Something is getting really boring now. It's tiresome. Okay, something it's just not working no more. It keeps failing over and over again. It's like somebody hitting a dead end. It's just not working. This could be somebody trying to ruin your reputation and all kind of shit. And if somebody's trying to do work on this divine masculine, bitch, you got another thing coming. They too fucking strong. Somebody is spying and looking into your energy and seeing that there's a masculine here. And bitch, that, that's, that should be your fucking cue to stop what the fuck you're doing and leave somebody the fuck alone. You bitches are hard of... Are you slow? I feel like y'all are really slow. Like dead ass. Dead ass. So somebody had high expectations for something and now it's not there. They they weakening. Their gifts is is is, is being taken away from their stupid ass. They feel sick or they 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 scared. They can't think straight. Page of swords in reverse is someone that's scatterbrained. Somebody can't see a fucking thing. 
Page of Swords in reverse with the sun in reverse. I'm gonna need a card here for, uh, for Aquarius. Yamoa, Y-E-M-O-J-A. Is it Yamoja or Yamoha? Maybe the J is silent. I don't know. I'm trying to uh, see if I can pronounce this name. Yamoja. Yamoja. Okay. So the J is not silent. All right, cool. All right, cool. Yamoja. Okay. So it says the key word is cleansing. Symbols are fish, salt water, cowrie shells, and mermaids. Your affirmation is I open myself to being cleansed of all that does not serve my highest good. So it says meet the goddess. Yamoja is the mother of all Orishas and the Patron. I mean, Patron. I don't know if a damn Patron. Somebody could like tequila. The Patreon or something like that, spirit of rivers and oceans. She has a special connection to the Ogun River in Nigeria and is a water deity in the Yoruba religion. Yamoja is associated with protection, especially children, women, and fishermen, childbirth, healing, and love. <laughs> she is often seen as a mermaid and has deep connections to the moon. Yamoja is, a, is an Orisha who cares for all of her children and when petitioned to do so, cleanses them of their sadness and eases their suffering. So your divination meaning, it says Yamoja has come into your reading today as it is time to cleanse an area of your life. Things have built up over time and this stagnation has affected your ability to manifest positive change in your life. By cleansing your space and decluttering your life, you will be able to create room for growth and opportunity. Yamoja may also be pointing you to wiping the slate clean and start again on a project or in a relationship. While this may feel like giving up or giving in, sometimes it is better to restart with a better foundation than keep doing doing a poor job on a shaky one. So it says work with Yamoja. Go for a swim, especially in the ocean or river if possible. Embrace your inner mermaid and work with these magical beings and carry out a cleansing ritual in your sacred space. Yeah, so your energy could be being cleansed right now. You need to call on Yamoja to help you cleanse this shit out of your damn energy. I didn't clarify this damn. What's this Queen of Cups up here doing? This Queen of Cups in reverse. Yeah, they failed at something. The world in reverse. Something here failed. Okay, somebody got to cut their losses. They're disappointed. They're upset. Okay, let's give me one more on the Queen of Cups in reverse with the world in reverse. So... This is a weak ass woman here. Whoever this queen of cups in reverse, they weak as fuck. Yeah, the death card in reverse. Somebody here don't want to change their ways. They just want to stay the same. They want to stay the same forever. Or somebody want to keep this cycle open with you where you were, what, emotionally immature? They feel like they can get you back into space. It's like, bitch, no, you cannot. But the death card in reverse, somebody don't want to let go of something. They don't want to transform. They keep failing at something, though, but they want to keep going on the same fucked up ass journey. Child. What's this Queen of Swords in reverse? 929 on the clock. The Two of Cups. What's the Queen of Swords in reverse? Two of Cups. Four of Wands. So yeah, somebody's just jealous. They're gossiping. They're lying. This person could be in a community gossiping. But I feel like this is you and your union. Two of Cups with the Four of Wands. This person mad as hell. <laughs> They're mad. Yeah, because this is what's being created. Or I feel like this is somebody mama that is taking up for this they, they daughter-in-law that's dating this fucking masculine here. They like weak hoes. They like weak hoes that they can manipulate. And you're not one of them. That's why they attack you. Because it's like, bitch, you got me fucked up. But I'm not for the fucking... And be with your raggedy ass son or your raggedy whatever, however the shit is going for you.
Is somebody here mad as fuck because you being loved on properly? I don't know why. I feel like this could be your own mama and a sister or... I don't know. It's different for everybody, though, so that could be the case. Try to listen. <laughs> but this was your reading, Aquarius. I hope this resonated. Okay, hopefully it will. I really don't want it to resonate with people, but it's coming out, so it does. Okay, but um, hopefully you got some clarity, rather. Like, comment, subscribe, turn your notification bell on, press the all button so you guys don't miss any of my readings, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.